This demo walks through the steps of pre-authorization and capture within SAGE 300 ERP. To begin, click on Order Entry and Order Entry Transactions, then select Order Entry again. A new screen will pop up. Here you will want to locate the customer. Click Select. Now we'll enter the line item. Select the item and click Select, and then enter the quantity ordered. Click on Pre-Authorize. Here, locate the payment code, we'll use SPS in this case, and click Select. Now select the option for Pre-Authorize. Here you will see the customer's information listed, and let's click on Process Pre-Authorization. This card was already on file, so we only need to enter the CVV, and click Next. You will now receive the message that the credit card has been pre-authorized. Click Close. From this screen, you also have the option to void if needed, but we'll close out of that screen. Now we'll go through the steps of capturing this transaction. Back on the Order Entry screen, we'll click on Shipment Entry. Again on this screen, we'll locate that same customer. And then locate the order number of the one we just created. You can make any updates and we'll change the quantity to two. Now we'll click on the capture button. Click on the Add Green button. And click Add. Now select the option for Charge. And you will see Credit Card Pre-Authorized, Not Captured. Select the option for Process Payment. And now you will see the pre-authorization has been captured. Click OK. Let's close out of that window. Here, back on the screen, you have the option to create an invoice. Click Post in order to do so. And here you have several options for printing, as well as the message that the posting has been completed. You have now gone through the steps of pre-authorization and capture within the SAGE 300 ERP software.